Okay, everybody, we're over here at 155 Monterey. So you'll see it's a really cute house. We're right over here at Monterey. Right now they're doing some water main work, so it's usually not like this, so don't worry about it. Um, it's listed with Andrew Herrera II, a uh, nice guy, great agent who's been around for a long time and really has a knack for preparing the house and getting everything ready. So we notice when we first come in, the seller's been here for 40 plus years. She's moved out, she's 92 years old and quite with it. They really prepared the house uh, as well. There was a terrazzo stairs going in, and this is a center patio variation of the Maria style house. So taking a look here. The nice thing is that we bought some double pane windows, we'll come back to that in a second. But over here, we've got this nice little extra area of light that comes in, some nice, a nice breeze. There's a nice completed family room downstairs. Over here you've got a quasi updated uh, vintage uh, kitchen. Uh, it's been cleaned up very nicely. You've got some gas appliances here, you've got the very big microwave, and you've got the skylight. I like this variation a lot. Some people have done where they rearrange kitchen or they put like a pot pan holder here and uh, a lot of choices, a lot of options too. The roof looks really solid as well. Take a look at that. The um, pest report that they did and the GCS inspection that they did, uh, the pest report came up to be about $1,800 too, which is a really great number considering the uh, vintage of the house. Well, actually, this house, is the vintage is older, but it, it has been really well maintained. I mean, it's bright, it's nice. Take a look at that. Over here, you've got the patio doors that go in, and wow, would you just take a look at that view? So that's uh, outer mission, Excelsior, and whatnot, and the rest of the sunny sides underneath. We do have some freeway lines because we're higher up here. But you see, that's uh, Mission Terrace over there, Excelsior, and uh, take a look at that. So interestingly, you have a pretty big deck compared to other people. A little dog up there, down there. It's a steeper block, it's steeper slope down, so you'd have to pay attention to um, retaining walls as well. But uh, taking a look back, you see some of the houses have been renovated, like that house has been nice there too. And take a look over there too, one of our happy colleagues. And take a look here, you've got the um, asbestos siding, which looks to be in very good and intact shape, which is what matters when that when you have that building material, because it's very commonly used and it's very stable, but part of the stability that that provides also proved to be uh, unhealthy to people. So let's take a look at the ceiling heights, because that's what I usually like to do. Eight foot three inches, and that's really nice as well. The wood floors are going to be finished and they're in great condition. Extra storage here as well for the kitchen. Take a look at this. So you can actually go down from that side. Oh, wow. And take a look at this. This is actually a nice generous size closet. Actually goes back a little more too than more than you expect. These are for your shoes, women for your heels, or well, men for your heels, depending on who has heels. Uh, but pretty nice. So let's take a look downstairs as well. So the downstairs is accessed through the kitchen. So we'll go through the kitchen again. You've got your dishwasher, refrigerator. Uh, taking a look down here. Let's go down here. Freshly relayed carpet. It smells like new carpet, so it's really nice. Let's take a look at this family room here. Nice big family room. It's got a little closet too, so in theory, I suppose you could use this as a bedroom. But it'd be a really nice big bedroom. Take a look at that. Nice glass as well. That's really, really pretty. Nicely regarded as well. Take a look here. You don't have the uh, three prong uh, electrical, so that may be an upgrade that you do over time. Let's see here. Let's take a look. Ceiling height down here. Huh, it's even taller, eight foot five, so that's nice. Walking through here, you'll see that we've got the laundry and the basement. Looks to be in really good shape too. You've got the concrete, maybe that's skin coat, maybe it's not, but it looks to be in good shape. Generally pretty solid. Sheetrock on the ceiling. You do have an older ventilation ductwork, but it comes into a newer unit. So it's been uh, upgraded in part. Over here, the electrical. Let's take a look here. You can see it looks to be square D, but this does have fuse boxes. So you'll probably want to update that. 
over time. And you do have an updated uh, furnace as well. Underneath your stairs, typical brick as we see, and then you've got the terrazzo going up and down. More storage down here. The pavement looks pretty good. Looks like there's some work here on the point, or the slab that is. You've got a little um, sink here, and that goes to the dryer. And you have what looks like to be an electric dryer here. So the venting is something that you probably want to look at because it comes out here now and it just empties out onto the other side. So eventually you probably just want to put a little uh, pipe and pump, pump it out there or maybe pump it out through. Uh, you can raise it up over here and pump out to the side or something. So that's something that you should look at because you don't want that dryer vent just to come out straight here. So let's take a look out in the backyard. Fairly intact, nice and solid. Really just great southern views. It's very warm, nice and warm down here. This fence has been redone recently, so it looks really nice. The stairs are pretty decent shape. Big cactus multiple things and I think that's a magnolia tree that will come back and it looks pretty nice too so it's really lovely I like to garden and I think there looks like there's a little irrigation system or if there was take a look up there there's our deck the deck looks to be in a solid shape but one thing that you want to consider over time is that uh, you might want to bolster the support uh, posts here maybe sort of something thicker like at the edge there you might want to have another one going down but, um, you know, nothing that was called out specifically or that we're aware of too. Um, but it is something you can definitely work on and improve. So that's just, let me just go, let's go through this way. We'll go up so you can get a full view of everything. Love the palm trees. Actually, that's, I think the palm trees belong to the uh, house that just sold, that Vanguard just sold. Maybe, maybe, yes, it does. That was 163 and that sold for 1.2. Eight. And that downstairs was more finished and had a bathroom and whatnot in this one. But taking a look here, very tall, nice and bright again. This is the telephone booth. Let's take a look here. Dining room here, and here. Happy listing agents. Okay. How are you? Good to see you. You've got the parquet. Great. Clean house. Parquet. Same owner for over 40 years. Hey, there we go. Go with it. She's 92. Oh, so it's yeah. fantastic. It's a happy house. Well, there we go. She took really good care of you. You can see you all double came with us. Hi there. How are you? Good. How are you? Good. Good. Thanks for coming.